What does good supply chain security entail? This video will talk about the need for supply chain security, outline practical steps to take to manage supply chain security. Councils rely on external suppliers to deliver devices, products and services. As a result, the ability to reduce the risk of a cyber attack and remain cyber resilient is also determined by the cyber security of organisations within a council supply chain. Cyber attacks can be carried out not only directly on your council, but also indirectly via your council supply chain. And cyber attacks can even happen through the supply chain of one of your suppliers. This is partly due to the fact that organisations in your supply chain may have limited resources, limited visibility of their own supply chains, and insufficient tools and expertise to evaluate cyber security. So what does a council do to deal with supply chain risk? Your council must develop a robust supply chain risk management framework. This framework requires you to ask, how much risk is my council willing to take? This is known as risk appetite. It helps in determining what risk is acceptable, since it is practically impossible to do away with all risk. You can then assign adequate levels of security controls to your council's contracts with suppliers, based on an assessment of risk facilitated by the framework. For example, perhaps a council wouldn't want to set aggressive controls on a refuge collection business who you've contracted to service a part of your local area and is not connected to your council systems. But it would want to set more stringent controls on the procurement of a major new system to collect council tax payments. Importantly, this depends on the council's risk appetite. Let's round off this video with other practical steps your council can take to beef up your supply chain security. Each council will need to identify the relevant people responsible for mitigating cyber risks in supply chains, so you can collaborate to develop council-wide, multidisciplinary approaches. Councils also need to provide supply chain security awareness and education for relevant staff and stakeholders. The threat landscape is constantly evolving with new risks and vulnerabilities. It is very important to always follow the most up-to-date guidance as given by the National Cyber Security Centre and other related government bodies. This video is part of a series designed to expand your understanding of digital, technology and cyber security concepts. The LGA has developed guidance on embedding cyber resilience in your supply chain. To find out more, please click the link that pops up on your screen.